From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Vicki Yates. After spending about half her life behind bars, Centoya Brown is now a free woman. Former Governor Bill Haslam granted her clemency request earlier this year, and as News Channel 5's Mo Hyder explains, she left the women's prison this morning. When she was behind bars, Centoya Brown certainly changed her life around, and by the looks of it, she's going to continue on that path. This week, Centoya Brown did release a statement saying in part, quote, I'm blessed to have a very supportive family and friends to support me in the days to come. I look forward to using my experiences to help other women and girls suffering abuse and exploitation. You do recall her case gained a national attention in the past year, thanks in part to celebrities and social media. She says she was a victim of sex trafficking when she was hired for sex and killed a man when she was 16 years old. She was ultimately sentenced to life in prison, which some believe was unfair. Now we're told she wants to use her story for a greater purpose. We learned this week she's working to release a book on her life. She also says she's going to continue her education at Lipscomb University, something she did while she was behind bars. And now that Brown has been in release, she still will be under parole supervision. In Nashville this morning, we'll hide her news channel five. From the weather front this afternoon, we'll keep an eye to the sky. A couple of strong storms are a possibility. We're watching a complex over Missouri to see how much of that may hold together and impact West Tennessee and Southern Middle Tennessee. 91 for you today, 70 tonight, 91 tomorrow. Temperatures remaining around the 90 degree mark for the weekend and in the next week. Going out to see the game tonight, Nashville Soccer Club with Hartford at First Tennessee Park. They will begin play at 7 p.m. Outside of a stray storm, temperatures in the mid 80s when that match gets underway. I'm meteorologist Leland Statham. Have a fantastic afternoon and evening.